The Kawai lure would have to be the lure that put Bond's lures on the map originally in New Zealand when we first started. I always used to fish on the west coast of New Zealand and uh, I kept getting asked, we should make a kawai, Bonds, you should make a kawai lure. Uh, well, this is the lure I came up with. It's just a generic plunger, medium plunger head um, and the closest to what I thought a kawai would look like. And uh, we were fishing at Hokianga the first weekend that I had this lure and I made two of them and I gave one to another boat. And I think there was five marlin caught that weekend and uh, three were caught on this lure. Um, were caught two myself on that lure. Uh, and that was the start of the kawai and it became famous as a west coast lure. Um, the Argonaut head originally. Now uh, it's had a few versions but this is the original shape right here, the kawai with the kawai skirt. Uh, great uh, lure in any position, any weather. Um, the modern version is keel balanced, has a keel weight in it, so you can run the single hook rig a lot easier in it now. It'll run a lot truer. Um, but yeah, this was the lure that uh, kicked everything off for Bond's lures, uh, and it's still a great lure today. And it's caught fish everywhere, everywhere in the world that I've fished. I take the kawai with me and I've caught fish uh, in, in every place. So it's not just a West Coast lure. Uh, it's exceptionally good on the East Coast here in New Zealand. Um, as I say, I've it's caught a number of blue marlin. I've caught a bunch of blue marlin on it myself. Um, I've caught blue marlin in Australia on it. I've caught blue marlin in the Azores on it. I've caught blue marlin in Hawaii on it. I've caught blue marlin in Cape Verde on it. So um, it just seems to be one of the most consistent producers. I tow one every day I fish on the Spellbound. It's normally my go-to uh, lure on the corner. Um, so it's, a, it's, a, it's pretty much a famous lure in the Bond stable. So it's well worth having that one in your spread. It's a super, super consistent producer.